Hello guys, Oscar here, and welcome to another video. Now, I know it's been a long time, and that's probably why you guys are all tuning in, is you want to know what happened. Well, don't worry, you can, you can search and wonder no more. I'm going to be telling you guys here in just a little bit. Let's get started. So, yeah, it's been... I believe about 35 days at the time of recording since I last uploaded a video. And uh, that kind of happened out of the blue, you know? I uploaded a video and then I just didn't. Uh, if you caught some streams, then you'll know I've been active. And if you've also been following me on Instagram and Twitter, I've also been active there. So you'll know what's going on a lot more if you've been paying attention there. Um, but the short answer is I took a break. And the longer answer is about to come. Um, it was a break and it moved into a lot of other things. Uh, let's get into that. Also, I should mention, um, it's nothing severe, what I'm talking about. It's not, not like, oh, I'm quitting YouTube, oh, nothing like that. I'm not going anywhere, uh, so get that out of your mind right now. It's nothing like that. Don't worry. So that begs the question, what did happen? Well, I took a two-week break. Uh, well, it started out as a one-week break for Christmas and the other holidays around that time. I decided to take a little bit of a break. Um, I was, you know, working on stuff with my family for the holidays. I didn't really have a lot of time to record anyway, so I thought, why not just take a break? So I took one uh, one week break and then actually another week after that just to sort of continue through the holidays and also my school break. Um, that, my intention was to start making videos as soon as the new year came around. But the thing is, uh, on New Year's Day, actually, not even not even a couple days into the new year, my computer totally broke. Um, yeah, if you're looking at tweets right now, I, I wasn't sure what was going on. My computer just randomly started rebooting and going into automatic repair. And that I tried fixing those issues, and I think I made them worse. I, don't, I, can't, I can't tell you for sure, but I might have made them worse. And um, eventually, nothing worked on my PC. Like, I couldn't really go into the BIOS even. I couldn't, like, I couldn't boot up. It was different issues every time. Sometimes my graphics card wasn't being, wasn't being, uh, detected. Other times, yeah, it was just, it was a whole crazy thing. And so I spent about five days trying to fix that on myself. It was like a Thursday, I think, or no, it was a Friday afternoon that it broke. And it was like Monday morning when I finally called, uh, a computer repair place because I thought I could do it myself, but I apparently couldn't. And, uh, yeah, so I wasn't sure what to do. So I made backups, thankfully, because one time it did restart on its own, and I actually got into my own PC, and I made backups of my worlds. And uh, then I think I tried making backups of my clips and stuff. But, um, yeah, anyway, long story short, that'll come in later. But long story short, uh, I got it to a, repair, a computer repair place, and they spent, well, their average turnaround time was one to three business days. It turned out to be, like, two weeks. Like, it was far more than one to three business days. It was kind of ridiculous, but I think the guy said he was working on the weekend and stuff, so it's not like they were lazing around. They were really trying to fix it for two weeks, and they actually pulled it off. They, I think it was a BIOS update they did, and uh, that apparently fixed it. Um, so, yeah, I got it back for a week. This was the week of, what did I have written down? Uh, about Wednesday the 15th. I, think, I can't remember what day of the week exactly, but it was around that time. So I got the PC back. It was great, but my upload days are on... Sundays, right? So that gives me four days to record, edit, and prepare a video for release. I didn't have that much time, so I decided, well, I'm going to make a really good video. I'll do spend a little extra time right now, and then do my usual schedule throughout the next week, and uh, it'll be good. Then I'll have a really good video to come back to that after, after that week, and it would be another week without video, which kind of sucked, but it seemed like a good plan. And that was a good plan. Everything was going really well. Um, everything was perfect. And then Friday, uh, Fridays, if you don't know, are the days that I edit my videos. I edit them and render them like as uh, like in that evening. And then Saturdays are the days that I make the thumbnail and everything like that. And so Friday came around, and I was actually sitting in an online class, and I went to go get like a drink of water, came back, and my online class had crashed. The whole Google Chrome browser had like crashed. I'm like, well, that's really weird. And I can't believe that happened. So I rejoined everything like that, explained what happened to my teacher. Everything's fine. And then as I'm sitting in class, my I get another blue screen error. This time it was a, a kernel security check failure, it said. And I'm like, what? No, it was fixed. And that was right after I paid $200 to get my Windows PC registered or um, like re-registered because I hadn't actually done that yet. After my build, it was still unregistered. So I registered that, paid $200 like the day before. And then here I am in math class giving the blue screen to death. And I was like, oh, no. So it rebooted. And I was like, okay, is it all right? I think it might be all right. And then so I got back into my class and it crashed again. 
and that was just the start. So I joined my class like on my iPad for the last like 10 minutes. Like it was, I just kind of stopped there and I spent the rest of the day and up through Saturday and Sunday trying to troubleshoot. And I eventually I came to the conclusion that it just wouldn't boot into Windows. Uh, and then I even tried reinstalling Windows and stuff. I actually took my regular drive out, not my Windows drive, but I took the regular just data drive out so that I wouldn't have to risk losing any data on that, including clips from my video that I recorded. And uh, so I took that out, and I was like, all right, I'm going I'm to get this fixed. It's the same issue every time. It's not like some crazy chaotic thing like it was before. And so I did that, and it seemed like it was kind of going all right. And then finally I got into the mentality of, well, it is broken. Maybe I can't fix it, but I can at least just, instead of worrying about the videos and school and stuff like that, I can just work on trying to fix it, like a project. And that was a nice mindset change, but it didn't fix my problem. And so finally I called the same computer replace, and I didn't get a message back for a while. So I kept trying to fix it, and finally I decided, like, okay, well... I think it's the motherboard because I tried replacing different components and seeing if that would change anything. And I came to the conclusion that it was either the motherboard or the CPU. And the CPU was in a nested socket, like perfectly covered, great thermals the whole time. So there's a very unlikely that the CPU decided to like be destroyed. And uh, so I reached out to MSI, my computer bo- motherboard manufacturer, and they said they could um, they could uh, do a return as per warranty, or not a, not a return, a repair. And so I was like, okay, so that sounds great. So I uninstalled everything. I actually checked the CPU for damage, didn't find any. So I'm like 99% sure that it's the motherboard. And I sent that off to them. And uh, that was, I sent that to them this Wednesday, which was Wednesday the, what was this Wednesday? Oh, I can't even remember. Well, it's the 28th right now. So that'd be the 27th. Uh, I shifted it on Wednesday the 27th yesterday. And that'll t- I figured that would take a couple of days to get to MSI in California. So I was like, all right. It'll be that maybe a week, and then it'll, I'll get it back. That'll be great. And I checked the email a little bit closer today, and uh, they said they do between thirty-five or uh, fifteen and thirty-five business days to repair, as well as um, what is it? As well as several days in processing and stuff. So it's going to be a while. Um, I'm going to be doing my best to just stay active on Twitter and Instagram like I have been, but I'm also going to be posting a couple more videos like this. I'm not really sure how I'm going to do that. Um, I'm on my old PC right now, in case you guys are wondering how I'm making this video. I'm on my old my old PC, uh, which I kind of don't want to go through again trying to record the super laggy, hard stuff. So I kind of want to just take a break on gaming for now until we get my motherboard back. And uh, if it does take that long, um, I'm really hoping it doesn't. I don't really want to get back to work in May. But um, if it does take that long, I might be considering just buying another motherboard of the same model because it's like a hundred bucks. Like I could just get it back, and then if I if they return mine, then I'll just have a spare motherboard. But yeah, so well, I'll keep you guys updated on that. Do more thinking. But that's what's been going on. Just computer issues this entire time. Uh, follow me on Instagram and Twitter if you want to see updates there. That would probably be the, your best bet because I won't be able to make many videos like this, and uh, that'd be great. You might have also noticed that I, I sound really different, and that is why, because right as I uh, my computer first started acting up at the start of the new year, I actually ordered a bunch of new stuff, like a mic and a, a bunch of sound foam and stuff, and that's all set up now. So right now I've got a super nice setup for the sound. It's a shame I don't have a computer to really work, work with it yet. But anyway, I will be getting videos out at some point, and uh, stick with me. Stay patient. I will be around. Um, until later, uh, this has been Oscar, I guess, and, it, all it, and uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. It really does mean a lot. And I'll see you guys in the next one, whenever that might be. Hopefully soon. I want to make more like this. This is kind of cool just recording my voice. But, yep, I will see you guys later. Stick, like, stick, uh, what am I saying? Stay close, I guess? I don't know. Stick to it. You know what I'm trying to say. But uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. See you.